Hey guys, how are you? Oh, it has been a day and I am enjoying a cup of tea. <laughs> it's just one of those days where I'm definitely noticing that I need to up the ante on self-care. Um, just looking after my health, um, boosting my immune system, getting some more sleep, um, definitely need to do some more yoga. So I did a yoga routine this morning, which was great. Um, if you haven't checked out the channel Mad Fit, um, I love her channel. She is awesome. I followed her for quite a long time too, like on her vegan channel. Um, she does like a lot of plant-based stuff and she's up in Canada. So, you know, we're close. We're close. We're just across the border from each other. So, <laughs> um, but yeah, she's lovely and her routines are fabulous and all the things. So definitely go check her out. Oh man. Today I was thinking about talking about some self-care types of things. Um, you know, with having an autoimmune system and I'm a mother of three young kids and I stay home and I, you know, I run all the errands, I do all the organizing, I do all the cooking, like all the things, like that's my job, right? And, and I love it, but you know, just like with any job, you can get burnt out. Especially with my energy levels, I need to be careful. The other thing is that, you know, with things are kind of crazy in the world right now with all of this COVID stuff, all of the, just all of the health protocols that are putting out there, you know, wear a mask, wash your hands, you know, just be careful, um, not having, being in too close of proximity to people, all the things. But I thought to talk about one thing that I've been doing to help me boost my immune system. So I am, um, part of that is this tea. And don't you love this mug too? I got it from a local artist that um, comes to a lot of our local art and craft fairs and he's amazing. It's awesome. So every time I pick one up, $5. What? Seal. So I don't know about you, but I really enjoy tea and it is, I just feel like it's so soothing. It's calming and it just, brings a bit of relaxation to me. So uh, something that I truly enjoy. And I actually never really got into tea until I met my husband. My husband is British. <laughs> and so, you know, a classic cliche, you know, uh, characteristic of a British person is their tea. So mind you, he likes to drink more black tea and I am more of a herbal gal. So, um, but I, the one thing I like about like teas and stuff is that they are more holistic and natural and don't breathe in a bunch of unnatural things into the body because I feel like we're already exposed to so much stuff in the world like that, that if we can minimize as much of that stuff as possible that we put into our bodies, the better. So this tea, and I came across this tea, it's by a company called like Welltopia. And this one in particular, it's immune defense tea. And I was immediately drawn to that because um, with my autoimmune disease, it's quite significant. And I have multiple sclerosis, chronic fatigue, fibromyalgia. Um, I kind of hit the jackpot with all these things. So um, anything that can help support my body naturally is key. And um, the, immediately when I open this bag too, it just smells amazing. It's like fruity, it's light and lovely. Um, it has so many core things in here that are great for boosting your immune system. So like echinacea, holy basil, safflower, chamomile, that's great for the relaxation. And the strawberry, cranberry, and blackberry pieces in here are just delightful. Oh my gosh, I could not wait to try this tea. So, um, I like too that it, like this package too is non-GMO, so it's not been the leaves of these uh, tea leaves and plants have not been sprayed with anything. There's no chemicals involved. Uh, there's no caffeine, which is great for my MS too. I can't have a lot of it because it really messes with me. Um, you know, gluten-free is key because I have to be gluten-free as well. And you know, it's made in the USA, third-party tested. Um, it's just fabulous. So I'm drinking. A couple uh, one to two bags of this a day and I'm good so mm-hmm oh there's just something lovely about it 
and the longer you let it steep too. I let it steep for maybe like five minutes. So I boil my kettle, pour it over top, and it just does the trick. And it, it, um, it really brings out, like it brings out all those flavors and the healing um, and aiding properties of the tea leaves in there. And it's not super sweet, but you can tell like from the berry extracts that, oh yeah, it's just great flavor. So if you would like to give this Welltopia tea a try, I will leave all of the information in the description box below and you can snag yourself a bag of this amazingness. So um, there are 30 eco-friendly tea bags that come in here and um, yeah, just like one bag of tea a day and you got yourself some immuno boosting power. So go check it out. You won't regret it. Hey right, guys, so there are also some other immune boosting uh, techniques that I utilize in my day. So I like to utilize essential oils. Um, I use them daily and I, I like to use like On Guard, which is a great immune defense um, blend of different oils all together in one bottle and they are fabulous. So I put that on my feet every morning, I roll it on there and depending on if I'm feeling really run down or not, I will put it on my wrists and maybe a little bit on my chest. So anything that can help support me is fabulous. The one that I use currently is from doTERRA and uh, they are fabulous too. They are organic, they are fabulously made and crafted and harvested and all the things. So if you'd like more information about that, we'll check that in the description box as well. Other things that I'm doing to boost my immune system are just eating healthy foods. So I'm sticking as close to my keto diet um, as possible, like I'm not eating any gluten because um, gluten can be tricky with having a, an immune system because a lot of that has to do with your gut lining. You just don't want any of those funky things like getting in the way of your health. So doing that, lots of sleep, minimizing my stress levels. And that one I think has been quite tricky too because, um, you know, all my children are home, um, but they're in a funk too, you know, like their world has been turned upside down as well. They're away from their friends, their routine, and their teachers and, um, you know, and. You know, I think of like as we as adults, like we don't quite fully understand what's going on, but neither do the kids. And I think the kids have a much lesser understanding of what is happening there too. So that's kind of tricky. I know that they're, they've been kind of having, or they've been more emotional than usual and, um, or maybe not be as pleasant to be around. So, mm -hmm. hello chamomile, right? So anyway, so that's kind of one of something that I've been having to try and do my best to to have that relaxation. So, which rolls into my next thing is like the yoga. Just relaxing, you know, you don't have to do it for super long. You could do it for 10, 15 minutes and just do some light stretching. You don't have to do a full massive routine. Anything just to give your body just a bit of relief and just to feel like, like it, it can just breathe for a minute and just have some calm. Uh, Cause I think, you know, outside of the situation that we've been in for a couple months now, you know, we're, we're exposed to so many things. We're exposed to a lot of situations and experiences that are very stressful in life. So whatever we can do to minimize that effect and exposure on our bodies, the better. Cause our bodies are super sensitive, right? Like even though we are strong, you know, they put up with a lot. Supplements. Supplements are the next thing that I'm going to talk about. Probably like my final thing. Like these are the core things that I'm currently doing in this like COVID pandemic situation. So I take extra vitamin D and magnesium to help out with my MS. Um, to make a long story short, my body can't absorb them as well, um, as well as other people. Um, and so what happens is, is like, I just, but the way it all works with the brain and whatever else, that's just how I have to, uh, I just, I just need that bit of extra for that. So I take that and I take some chromium picolate 
and um, a vit uh, multivitamin and um, I'm trying to think like a omega. I didn't make sure I have like some type of a fish oil or um, like a natural omega three to make sure that I get the healthy fats. And um, it's great for brain function and that kind of stuff too. And um, mind you too, I will list everything in the description box below of what I take to help boost my immune system and to make sure that everything stays in working order. I think I'll probably let you go. You've been here a while. Thank you for hanging out for me, <laughs> with me for this long. So, oh, I think I'm gonna go outside and have a walk for a bit and just enjoy some fresh air and um, just soak up that goodness because I think now we need to find the joy in the little things, find the joy in um, what is naturally shared and provided for us. So um, when we can't go out and do the normal things, we need to find the joy in the little things that we don't normally pay as much attention to. So I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my tea and yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Take care guys.